Hey guys, it is Arika Misha, and good morning. It's time to cook some breakfast. I've been craving bacon and eggs and grits all week. Now this is an old school breakfast right here. Bacon, eggs, and grits. Simple, easy. And I got my quick five minute grits. Y'all know how I like to do it. I like to make it quick and easy for y'all. Getting y'all in and out the kitchen. Cause I know I'm ready to get out of this kitchen already. But I'm gonna get my bacon, egg, and grits. All right, we got some little quick smith feel thick cut. Y'all know I like that thick cut bacon. We got the thick cut bacon, Smithfield. We got the Publix Large Grade A eggs. And we got our quick five minute Jimmy Dandy grits. Jimmy Dandy, them some old school grits right there. Oh, they got my meal right there on the, look at that, they got the bacon, eggs, and the grits right there. Them ain't the kind of eggs I like, but anyway. All right, y'all. So, let's get to cooking. Let's go, this is gonna be a quick video. All right, y'all, let's go ahead and get this bacon tray up. Quick and easy, quick and easy. Let's get our Smithfield bacon all pulled out here. And I just uh, get two trays. I just tray my bacon up real quick. I'm telling y'all, I'll just be throwing it in the oven. I got my oven preheating over there. Now this thick bacon. I don't know how this thick bacon is. This thick bacon needs room. All right, going over here to our second pan. Quick, 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 y'all. I just be throwing it on that. Y'all see? Try ain't nothing but bacon. Just throw it on your pan to keep moving. All right, that fits perfect. And I usually have one, and I just kind of Put it across the top like that. Usually, I have another piece of bacon and I put it over here too. So, Smithfield, I'm missing a piece of bacon. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah, I'm missing a piece of bacon because I usually have six on this pan with a piece right here and six on this pan with a piece right there. Smithfield, I don't know where my other bacon at, but that's all right. I ain't mad about it. I'm telling y'all, I know my food. I know my food. All right, so we got our bacon all trade up. Y'all see how I do it quick and easy. This that thick cut bacon. Quick, quick, quick. Th 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 th. I put my little foil over my pan. So when it's getting all greasy and stuff, and when it get through and I pull that oil off the pan, I just take that little foil, ball it up, wrap it up, throw it in the garbage. And I just kind of wipe my pan, um, my pan off with my towel. That's it. Easy clean up. Easy clean up. I'm trying to tell y'all. I be trying to help y'all out. That's all I be trying to do. By taking the things that I have learned and showing y'all. Now you either take it or you leave it. That's all I can say. All right, let's get this bacon in the oven and we're gonna move on over to the stove to these eggs and grits. Okay, let's get these eggs whipped up. Quick and easy breakfast this morning. Got our scrambled eggs over here. Y'all know how I do it with my scrambled eggs, quick and easy. Put me some salt in it. Just a little bit. I don't do too much salt because I got the bacon already. And trying to cut back on that salt, y'all. The older you get, the more problems you have with your health. <laughs> oh, I guess it's just an individual thing, but that salt been getting me, so I've been having to, my doctor said you better cut back on that salt, girl. So, y'all know me. I've been cutting back on my salt now. That salt be swelling me up. And y'all know I always put a little bit of milk in my eggs. Get my eggs all nice and scrambled. I just kind of turn my bowl sometimes. Make it quick and easy. Don't scramble your eggs to death. All right, we got our butter over here on the stove. Let's go over to our stove because the butter is already ready already. The butter is ready already. All right, calm down, butter. Calm down. 
can get my fan on. See that butter already ready? Get my fan on. Go ahead and get them eggs poured in. I don't see me cook my eggs, but this is part of the meal, so I'm gonna go ahead and cook them up again for you all. I love scrambling my eggs. Nice, quick, and easy, because we ain't got all day to be in this kitchen, you all. We ain't got all day. So, let's get these eggs scrambled up. We got that bacon in the oven, whole house smelling like bacon. Ooh wee! Whole house smelling like bacon, like a bacon factory. I love it. Bacon, eggs, and grits. That's a simple, old school, classic breakfast. Classic breakfast. All week, I'm telling you. I've been craving it all week. Y'all know I just kind of fold my eggs around. I don't do the whole scrambling thing. I like for my eggs to be nice and fluffy. They just look prettier that way. Nice and fluffy. Ain't add my parsley yet. But we'll get that parsley in there. Let's get these eggs cooked first. Cut my heat down. I always cook my eggs on a medium high heat. You do not need, like I always say, you don't need high heat to scramble eggs. They're scrambling eggs. They don't need too much heat. They don't need too much help. So I'm getting these eggs all scrambled up. Looking good. <coughs> oh, excuse me, y'all. Looking good. It's early in the morning, y'all. My boy's still trying to wake up. I'm telling y'all. Scrambling these eggs. It is early in the morning. Early in the morning. I'll be up early, baby. Early bird catch the worm. I know y'all heard that before. <clears throat> Get up. <clears throat> Stop sleeping in all the time. Get up. Get your day going. I like getting up early in the morning. Get my day going and get everything done and over with. And you see, you know what? I can just relax for the rest of the day. That's just me. But you know what? That's the word of the day. Get up. Get up sometimes. Get up and do something. Get up and get stuff done sleeping in all the time. Get on up. Get stuff done. That's the word of the day. That's what's in my spirit. Get on up. Get up and get it done. Sleeping in all the time. Sometimes ain't nothing wrong with sleeping in. I ain't saying that now y'all. I'm just talking from my experience. Y'all know how I do it. I ain't here to judge nobody. But sometimes we just got to get up. Okay, y'all. Y'all done seen me scramble my eggs a million times. I don't want to turn this into a 20-minute video. I'm going to go ahead and finish getting these eggs done, and we're going to move over to the grits. All right, y'all. Last but not least, I've got my water boiling with my grits. I'm going to go ahead. I've got my butter, salt. Got everything all nice and boiling already. I'm doing one full cup of grits. Go ahead and get them going. Stir those in. I'm going to cut my heat down. Cutting my heat down to a medium, medium high heat. Stirring those grits in. I might add a little milk. When you add a little milk, it makes your grits all nice and creamy. My mom used to make them like that old school creamy grits. Oh yeah. I do that to my grits sometimes. Remind me of when I was a kid. That's what it does for me. Mm-mm-mm. I'm that five-year-old little girl eating them creamy grits, ain't got no bills to pay. All I'm doing is just living my best life. That's how it make me feel when I eat them creamy grits. I think I might add some milk to these today. I feel like feeling like that. Uh, I like to keep stirring my grits because y'all know grits like to get all lumpy and cake together. So I stir them up for a minute so you don't start, see? How the grits, they like to clunk up together. I don't know why grits do that, but they like to get in clunks. I can't stand them clunks. So I just make sure everything all nicely stirred up. Make sure all my grits stirred up there.
Mm, mm, mm. All right, y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and get them grits covered up. Five minutes, cover them up for five minutes, and that's it. Quick, easy grits. All right, y'all, I'll be back with the grand finale. All right, y'all, our quick grand finale. We got everything cooked up. We got parsley in our grits. Ooh, look at those grits. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, yes. Old school grits right there. Old school grits for the soul. Let's go over here to the bacon and the eggs. Ooh. Come on, camera. Don't do that to us. Come on, camera. Come on. Come on, camera. Mm -mm -mm. Take y'all in. Slowly. Ooh. Wee. Yes, Lord Jesus. Yes, God. Mm -mm 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 -mm. All right, y'all. Y'all seen me do it, so you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, that knowledge always power. Bye.